Assalamu alaikum. Uh, this is a case where we have uh, an impression, and I was discussing with the student why is it incorrect. Okay, first of all, we're looking for a role of material. Do you think this role is present all around? No. no. Not, uh, not equal on both sides. Or something no. else. Something else. Do you think your buckle sulcus around the buckle shelf area is lower or higher than the sulcus in the uh, labial area? It should be lower than the bone attachment will muscles are lower. This sulcus or this flange should be higher. The sulcus in the tissue, this is called the flange. The flange of the impression should be higher than this one. Okay, so this is deficient. So I discussed with you, and also this is deficient. I discussed with you earlier what was the problem, what might cause this? Maybe tray size. Tray size is small. How do I know this? If we look at the size of material, look, I need for this material four to six millimeters. Okay, now this material here is the thickness outside the tray. What should be is the thickness inside the tray. So the tray was small. Okay, زائد plus the insufficient material amount. Okay, with and incorrect borders. Could another reason could be the way you press? How did you press this? It should be pressed from back to anterior. Back to anterior. So pressing from anterior to back. Watch the material. It's more outside the tray here rather than going here. Also, maybe when you enter, the lip was not was tight. Jammed or stretched, overstretched. It's tight, so it wiped away the material. Look, we have excess material, but it didn't go up. Maybe when you enter, the lip was tight and bumped into the impression while it was it was up. So make sure when you enter to the mouth, okay, before pressing vertically or seating vertically, take the lips out and then vertically seat. Because I see excess. There is a lot of excess here. Why did it go into the sulci? That means the lip also had some role in moving it away, swiping it away. It bumped into it and it moved it away from the edges of the tray. What we want to have is enter the tray, remove the lip and the cheeks, make them wide, and then go vertically into the support area. Okay? So this is my recommendations for this case. Thank you.